Hi everyone! I just wanted to make a quick video and show you guys some new items that I got for back to school. If you've seen my post then you would know that to get into the spirit of back to school I got my hair done and I got the ombre done but you can't really tell right now. Right now I have my hair up in a bun and I have it up in a donut in the largest size that they make it in. It looks so cool. Today someone told me it looked like Audrey Hepburn so I was really excited. Um, so that's a trend that actually I've been embracing since the springtime and I think it's great also for fall. So it's definitely something I'm going to keep doing. And so in terms of my fall shopping, I tried to get a lot of silk shirts because that's something that I really like. And I liked it for the past seasons, but I think it's a really nice transition into kind of the colder weather. So basically everything that I purchased, I got at Nordstrom, and I got most of it during the sale. So, the first thing that I got is a black silk top. It's pretty plain. It's pretty basic, except if you can notice, it's more sheer on the bottom, like when it hits the bottom of, you know, like your torso. And I like it because that means you don't have to wear a tank top with it if you don't want to, because the top really isn't that sheer. And, I mean, the arms are sheer, so that's, like, a really nice effect. And I love the fact that the back, where it is sheer, at the bottom there's a slit. So it gives the effect of being, like, a faux tuxedo look, which is really nice, and it's really different. And the fact that it's long, you can wear it with leggings, or you could wear it with pants. So it's nice to have that option with the shirt. And then another silk shirt that I got during the sale is a plain, well it's not that plain, it's beige and it has trim on it, trim around the collar, going down the center and even on the cuff and basically the trim is cheetah print and I love cheetah print, I love all animal print but I thought this was so cute, I know they had it in um, a three quarter length sleeve and they also had it in a tank top version but I like the long sleeve version, I think it would look really nice with like colored jeans, maybe like bright blue electric blue pants or something and maybe like a nude patent ballet flat. So many different ways that you could wear that because I kind of feel like cheetah print is a neutral. So it would match a lot. And the last item that's kind of fancy are these leggings. I mean, they're not that fancy, but you know, basically they're stretchy. And then on the side, they have this leather, which is so great because my leather boots are leather in the front. And then the back is like this nylon stretch. So it kind of reaches like the middle of it. So it's interesting that if I wore them together, where the leather would cut off on the boot, on the legging, it would be on the side. It would just look really cool and different. But also it would look really nice with like ballet flats. Or even, I'm loving those new sneakers that have the wedge on them. I think that would look really cool with these. Depending on, like, what color you got them in. And then, I wanted to go for a little bit more of a casual look. Because I don't always want to wear silk shirts. Especially if it's raining out or something. I think it's nice to have more of a casual option. So I got this sweatshirt. And I've been wanting one for a really long time. I got it from Nordstrom as well. And... It is gray, and the pulls are white, and the inside is fleece, so it's just like a typical sweatshirt. It's got a hood. It's so cute. I just think that I, I really like to wear graphic tees, and I think it would be like a really nice compliment to them. Even if you do have on like a silk tank top, I think it would look so cute. I feel like they're really in right now, so it's a great staple to have in your wardrobe, and it really wasn't that expensive. And then the last article of clothing is my favorite and it is jeans from Nordstrom that have these roses on them. They're pink roses and it's almost like a gray denim background. They're so amazing and they're so cute. They're by the brand Love Fire and I like this brand a lot because I have three pairs of colored denim. I have bright blue, um, a magenta color, and green and they're all by this brand so I really like I'm comfortable in this brand, except these jeans are more denim -y, so they did fit a little bit weirder, but what's great about Nordstrom is that you can get free alterations if you have a Nordstrom card, so 
it really worked out perfectly. So that's all the clothing, but I did invest in a few accessories as well. Nothing major, but just to spice up my wardrobe, my outfit. So one thing I got was this new phone case, and it's faux snakeskin. It's by Rebecca Minkoff. It's so cute. It says Rebecca Minkoff on the side. And it came in like a bright blue and like a white, and the white looked the most like snakeskin, but I don't really like snakeskin. So it's weird that I really wanted this, but I just thought it was so cute. I think I was kind of inspired by Pretty Little Liars, where Hannah has the bird case, the bird's nest case, but I didn't want the same exact thing because I knew I was going to drop my phone. So this is like a hard plastic. Um... I did buy it at the Nordstrom sale, so I've had it for about a month, and the graphic isn't coming off or anything, so it's perfect, and it really does tend to, like, add color to any outfit that I'm wearing, so I love that, and finally is my handbag that I got. I like to invest in one handbag pretty much each season. I like to change it up, but I kind of believe that a handbag is the investment piece of a wardrobe. So the bag I got is actually from a few seasons ago. It's by Rebecca Minkoff and I saw it. I really liked it but I couldn't find it for a while so when I found it I really grabbed it. I'm obsessed. So this is it. It's a big bag. It has these two quilted pockets in the front and on the side and going around the bottom are these gold spikes and even on the handle. I like it because it's not very typical Rebecca Minkoff. You're not going to see yourself coming and going in it, um, meaning that lot, not a lot of people are going to have it. And so I like that different quality. And I just like it because I like studs and spikes. And sometimes I really like that more of a punk grunge look. And I think that even if I am wearing a silk shirt, like even if I was wearing this butterfly shirt with the bag, it kind of gives it like an edge to it that I really like. Something different. So those are currently my new fall obsessions. So I have posted about my hair and now I've posted about my clothing. So keep watching because I'm going to be posting one about jewelry soon. Okay, bye.